Hi folks, welcome back to my channel, hope you're all doing well. I'm in Cleveland this afternoon um, because I just thought I would nip out and do this video. Um, I do need to nip to B&M to get some shelves for my desk because um, I want some white shelves to match my uh, theme of the desk. But I just thought I'd nip out and uh, do this video this afternoon because it's quite nice and uh, the Cleveland's promenade is quite busy. So um, before we get into this video, um, I believe Future Peter has um, has filmed a, uh, an uh, intro for this video, so I shall catch you folks in a minute. I'm in Cleveland, Cleveland this afternoon. Um, it's quite busy. The beach is quite busy. Uh, the sun's out as well, so the sun is like blaring up there. Uh, but I hope you're all doing well. Um, we're going to have a look at Mary's shell actually, because uh, Mary's shell is uh, the sea is out, as you can see. There's all the waves and stuff. Um, but yeah, I just thought it would. Uh, I, I charged my gimbal up last night and um, I charged my phone up as well. And I thought because I'm uh, because I'm in Cleveland tomorrow afternoon. Well, it's just, it, it's still the morning now, I think. Uh, what time is it? I'm not sure. Um, I just thought I might as well just, just film this video, just whilst I'm here. Uh, we're going to have the promenade as well. There's the, uh, there's a view and the, uh, and the gyms as well. That, there's the gym, the view and the, uh, the gyms. And that's the old Jubilee pub there as well. Hope you all can see this one. Going off look at the Star Wars Cafe as well, I uh, do need to film a couple more POV um, clips because um, the past few days, yeah, the past few, uh, the past couple of days I've been um, researching camera techniques uh, that I can use in my vlogs. Um, as you folks know, I can hear a drone somewhere, I'm not sure where it is. Anyway, um, as you folks know, I'm big on sort of camera techniques and, um, you know, trying to get the best camera um, camera work done and um, I especially like I, I take all my inspiration from like films and TV shows and stuff there's the yoga over there as well we'll go down, we'll go down onto the beach because uh, the, uh, the sea's out at the moment um, I take all my inspiration from like films and TV shows and, and stuff like that um, so I've really been sort of the past couple of days I've been um, watching YouTube videos on uh, sort of tips and tricks on how to get the best uh, camera angles and um, sort of techniques and stuff like that I can use with my gimbal. Um, so the, the, the videos that people do, it's just, uh, you just go up and pay The yoga's over here. He's buried in the sand as well. Um, but yeah, I've, t I've taken inspiration, and as you folks know, I'm always learning sort of um, new camera techniques and stuff in my videos. And you may have seen that, in that little, little intro, uh, the whip transitions that I've done in that <laughs> intro. I actually learned those yesterday. Um, I'll pop the clip. I'll pop the clip. I feel last night in Fleetwood. Um, trying to be careful of the water. Um, and then I will get back to you um, at the yoga because it's, it's right here.
that. Um, as I said, uh, I'll get, we'll get a little, shall we? Actually, shall we face this way towards the sun? It might be better. Um, I, I, I was watching a video last night and um, I went out. I went out yesterday evening to film that. So I can't see the screen, so I really hope you both can see. Um, I went out yesterday evening to film that video after watching that. And uh, yeah, it's just, it turned out so well, it turned out better than I expected it to be to the light turn out. Um, you can see his eyes there as well. I need to take a couple of photos actually for the, uh, for the thumbnail. I'll do that yeah, now. so we'll leave the yoga behind. Uh, we'll have a look at Mary's shell actually. Uh, but yeah, um, I love, I love watching YouTube videos and um, even when I'm not like uploading uh, content. I'm always watching videos of like how, how people film stuff and I take that on board and I'm like a sponge me. Um, I see something and then it sort of stays in the front of the And um, I'll let have a Said, uh, once I see something, it stays with me forever. And yesterday, when I was watching that video, um, I thought instead of going to sleep, so I'm going for it, I'm go out and go out. Cleaver's Beach at the moment as well, um, and I'm going off look at the Star Wars Cafe as well. It's one of my favourite towns as I absolutely I love it here. Um, I've ordered a couple of, uh, I've, I've been collecting Funko Pops again as well. Yeah, um, ever since I went to watch uh, the new Aquaman film at the cinema, um, those films are just so, so good, they really are. Um, I have ordered a Aquaman Funko Pop. Well, I bought one from Blackpool when I went shopping, Bla shopping in Blackpool the other day. I got one from um, Blackpool. I'll pop, I'll pop the photo on screen for you now so you folks can see. And then I ordered um, Mira, um, which is his, which is Aquaman's, um, Aquaman's girlfriend in, in the film. Those films are just so, so good. Like, it's, it's, it's like, the, uh, the camera moves and stuff in those in those films just so good. Um, might watch number one again because number one was really good. And but number number two is the is the one that I went to watch at the at the at the, uh, at the cinema back there. Um, I will be at a cinema point towards the end of the month because um, the new the new Godzilla the new Godzilla film is out as well. Um, end of uh, end of this month so I mean, this is, that's the trail of that looks so so good um, yeah let's go to the there and show shall we um, I think what else there is to update you folks on uh, love a bit of a chat uh, I'll probably come back along the promenade actually once I've been to B&M and then we'll go and we'll sort of continue, continue the video on from um, from here so uh, I'm going to get a couple more POV shots from here and then I shall catch you folks once I'm out of being there. Because uh, I need to sort of focus on what I need to get in there. So. Um, yeah, I shall catch you folks. Okay, folks. So I'm out of being there now. I've just got some uh, got some stuff. There's a, there was a horse just past me, and there was a girl riding the horse. She she asked me if, if it was all right, and uh, I asked her if she was all right. And I said it, she startled me then. I just didn't know where it was. Uh, where it, I didn't. Uh, no, she was at the side of me. But I've just got some shells and stuff from uh, B&M, some white shells. I didn't think they actually, uh, what do you call it? I was looking around and I was like, I got to the shells and I was like, have they got any in? 
and, I, th and I, d I, d I didn't see them there and I thought, oh god, I'm, I'm going to have to go somewhere else now, but they were directly behind me, the ones that I wanted, because uh, they are some cube shells that I wanted, so uh, they're from my desk, it's just a match for wine, this theme on my desk, it's the ones that have got like an oak effect, and they don't really match my desk theme, so I really wanted some like white uh, shells. I bought some artificial grass as well from a hamster. I put some in for him and I've still got a bit left. So my thinking is, these white shells that I just bought, um, on the inside at the bottom, I'm going to put some white grass. I've just got some new artificial plants as well. I've got a bag in there because I'm going to start decluttering some of my stuff because I just don't need... I've, I've, got, a, I've got a collecting issue, okay? Uh, just, just leave it at that. Um, I do have a bit of a collecting issue. I'm a bit of a hoarder when it comes to uh, collecting things. Um, my uh, second Aquaman pop has just arrived as well because uh, my brother just rang me. These these ones look so so like Stormy's desk. Don't you folks think it is raining? And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk back to, um, I'm going to walk back along the uh, other side of the road to get my tram home. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I hope y'all can see me in here by uh, with the wind. Um, I do have a wind muff which I'm going to attach to my to, my, to this phone uh, for future vlogs and stuff. Because I want to do, um, I want to do a few more like videos from Cleveland. I want to do an ASMR one just like in the evening when it's a really nice evening. Walking through town and just not not talking in the video. Walking along the promenade and just not talking as well. Uh, my gimbal on my phone is getting a little bit wet now, but um, yeah, this is that's what my thinking was for those shells um, because I wanted it, I wanted some shells to like match. And uh, my second Aquaman pop is uh, Mira that came today. Uh, I'll have a look at her, look at her when I get home, which I'll pop, I'll pop a video clip in the video in this vlog. Um, but yeah, the sea is in now as well. I'm not sure how long I was in B and M for. Well, I was in there for a good half an hour, 45 minutes, look, just looking around. So uh, yeah, the sea is um, the sea is in now. That came in pretty fast, to be quite honest. Um, it's closer to like Mary Shell now as well. Um, Mary Shell will be sort of more or less covered in the water in the next hour so um, but I will be back at the uh, at the view cinema on um, I think it's the 20, 22nd or 29th the um, the thingy film uh, the new Godzilla film is released so the trailer for that just looks so so good but just look at this, uh, this yeah. I'm, to, I'm not going to go down there because uh, yeah I'm not going to go down there because I don't want to get trapped by the sea because the sea does it does come all the way up to these steps here. So hope you can see this uh, the thing go around because I can't I can't see it properly. But we're going to have a quick look at the Star Wars Cafe. So there's the view. Favourite cinema in Cleveland is like uh, there's the new one that's opening up in Blackpool that's just opened up in Blackpool rather called the back lot. But I think the view, the view cinema will be staying for those that don't want to travel far. So they've got the pick of the two, and I think that I think the one in Blackpool has just got the one, the one screen. It's an IMAX screen and it's the biggest in Lancashire apparently. So I'm gonna, I'm, I'm going to nip in there um, into the new IMAX in Blackpool um, to see a film. I'm not sure which film. Um, yeah, I'm not sure which film to, to see. But um, I will be back at this one uh, to see the new Godzilla, definitely, because it's just, uh, the trailer for that just looks so, so good. There's a few people back on the beach as well, walking the dogs, which is cool. Um, yeah, hope you're all doing well. Uh, like I said at the start of this video, um, I've been sort of researching uh, camera techniques and stuff, uh, sort of sort of things that I can uh, in incorporate into my own videos as well. Um, so the, 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 the whip transitions that I just did at the start of this, this video, they will be more, um, they will they will happen more frequently in the videos as well. Turn back. 
yeah those will happen more frequent frequently so uh, stay tuned for those because i really enjoy doing that um but uh, yeah. nothing really to update you folks on with my personal life you know i'm i'm quite happy on my own i've taken a step back from dating as well i'm not dating a girl at the moment even though it would be nice to have in the future but um here. Um, you know, like, um, yeah, it would be nice to sort of date a girl in the future. I've just, I've just taken a step back from it because it was mentally draining me. I'm trying to find someone, but um, at the moment I'm sort of, I've, I've, uh, I'm, I'm, up, I'm, up, I'm uploading more on my TikTok lately, so I'll pop my TikTok on screen for you now so you can see. I've started talking to this Scottish girl on TikTok now. Oh God. You see where we was down there, down there earlier really on? Look at the, look at the yoga now. I can't see the screen properly. The yoga is pretty much covered in water. It's crazy. But yeah, I've started talking to a Scottish girl on TikTok. Uh, she said that we would uh, make. She said that we would get along real well. Really, really, really well. Um, so, so, but, uh, it's just like we're just talking on TikTok at the moment, so nothing like major. But uh, yeah, I've just sort of taken a step back from like dating and talking to to girls. But I just um, I, I don't mind talking to girls for like you know friendship and stuff. Um, but the, the 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 Scottish one, I don't know. I just find the Scottish accent and girls like really. Um, we're going off a quick look, quick look at the what compound of Rogers last we're up here. I just find um, Scottish accent and girls like really like cute and stuff. I don't know, it's just because uh, Scottish accent in girls is just, is really um, prominent and like what's the other word for it? I won't call it fresh because it's, it's 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 something that it's an accent that they were actually born with. But um, it's sort of prominent and genuine. That's what I'm sort of trying to say. Yeah, Mary's, uh, Mary's shell is uh, it's probably going to be covered in water in the next hour or so. Getting out of breath doing this video. Uh, this, this, yeah, the, sea is, um, the sea is coming in right now. So. There's Mary's shell down there. But yeah, let's go now. God, this beach up here is, uh, is busy. Quite a lot of people around, even though it's like spitting at the moment. It's not, it's not majorly, majorly like windy or anything. But raining. Yeah, here's the, uh, here's where the Star Wars is filmed, by the way. The Star Wars camp. And if you just peek through this hole here, that's sort of where it was all filmed. Through there. Pretty big production as well, to be honest. We've got some prices of the uh, of the food here. Look at this: regular chips, two pounds seventy; large chips, three fifty. Folks can see that. Uh, I haven't watched what that includes. And the chip bomb is three pounds twenty. That's all right, isn't it? Not bad for the uh, watch part. It's not bad for the uh, prices for the um, FB cafe where the Star Wars was filmed. Um, but yeah, let's go and uh, carry on, shall we? Hope the lens isn't getting too wet. Um, I'll actually nip down, we go down these steps onto the beach and just see the waves quickly. I don't want to go like too far down or anything. I think it's like one o'clock. I've had nothing to eat yet. Uh, I might nip to the butchers before I nip going home. Just got a couple of pork patties or pork pies or something. Yeah, I'll do it way in here. Go, go, go this way in because these rocks are like much more. A bit unsafe. This, this, uh, that's the thing with beaches is they can be a bit unsteady and a bit unsafe sometimes. Just see my shelf in this gap here.
there with myself. Just shut my lens a minute, mate, so there's no water on it. There shouldn't be. It should be okay. But yeah, the waves, the sea is just coming in right now. There's Mary Shell over there as well. It's been a pretty nice, uh, well, morning. Like, what time is it now? Uh, I'm just gonna go and check there, see what time it is. I've, just, I've no idea what time it is. I think it's like. I just need to get home because I really want to look at that Funko Pop that I've got. Because uh, as I said, the, uh, the Aquaman films, the Aquaman film that I went to see at the cinema, the, the second one, really, really good. And then I obviously had to watch the um, Pops, yeah, that shit. I had to watch the first one as well. And since I've been to the cinema, I've watched the second one like three times because it was just so, so good. The camera movements in that film was so good. The story's funny. Jason Momoa, he's so, so funny in, in that film as well. Uh, I feel like anything with Jason Momoa in it, it's just, it's just going to be comedy gold. It's just, it's, 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 it's the, the energy that he brings to the film is just really, really good. So, uh, he, was, he was in the new Fast and Furious, uh, Fast and Furious 10 film as well, was Jason. Whoa, we don't get too close. I don't want to get too close to these waves because they will, uh, they will bite me. They will bite my feet off these waves. Plus, I've got to be an ant bag as well. And I don't really want to be, uh, yeah. But look at this. Right, we'll carry on because uh, that is such ASMR, that isn't it? Though I had to ask a lady in there if she, if she can double double bag bag for me because uh, I've got shelves in here. I've got three like three candles. I've got some glass bits as well. Wow, this is like so calming to study here, listening in to these waves. As I said, they are. We are working on the uh, the beach works at the moment as well. Plastic in the ocean. That is a look at that. That is an old ferry box that, isn't it? Ferry liquid. God. Just shows you how long the ocean's been around folks. Right. I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah, we'll go back up here now actually because I don't want to be uh, I don't want to be what you call it. Oh, shall we go back that way? Yeah, we'll go back this way. Uh, I'll say we'll go up down the steps from there. Uh, but yeah, that's it. A uh, bit of a bit of life update. I've not really been doing much, I've just been doing some gaming. Uh, thinking of new video ideas, I need to write down the videos that I want to do so that I don't forget to do them, because I will, because I've got to forget for mine, and uh, yeah, so I'm going to get myself back to the tram stop now and get, get, get myself home, um, I'll be in Cleveland next when it's uh, cinema time, um, again it's one of my favourite towns, this is, uh, yeah just something about Cleveland, it's just a little bit more peaceful than Blackpool, and that's what's saying something, so. Uh, we can go up this ramp, I think. This, this purpose built ramp for the. Uh... God, you see all the tire marks where well, well, lorries have been to, 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 to deliver the rocks on the, on the beach. Yeah, it's a bit of a nice uh, afternoon this evening. As I said, we are um, doing the beach work at the moment still, so it's quite a long walk here. I don't think these are going to be staying here, these deep rocks. Oh, there's a big puddle there, I've not been through that. We'll just up the, up the steps here. 
It's a big, great, big, huge puddle there. I'm not, not going to walk through that. Not that. Uh, but, yeah. Ooh, this, this, will make, this will make a nice seat, wouldn't it? If, the, if someone took this off the beach. That'll make a nice uh, seat for someone. But that's heavy though, isn't it? I wonder where that's come from. See, all this wooden stuff here has just been washed up from the sea. All these sticks and stuff. Yeah, I'm going to get myself off these steps here now. Uh, I think this is part of this, this, see this black netting here. Um, just there. This is used for um, under, this is what the rocks sit on underneath the beach. So we actually got to put that to the, um, I think it's called a cell, a cell membrane, I think. And it sort of goes under the beach. And then that's what the rocks and stuff sit on. Oh God, that car was loud. I'm going to get all these steps here. Uh, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this book walk around Cliffy's promenade. Um, I'll probably end it from here. Got a bit of a sign there saying about the water. I'm losing my glasses here. See, that's another thing as well. I've been sort of struggling with my... Um, been sort of struggling with my dry skin. At the moment, I've got, I've got so such bad dry, dry skin. This bag's getting heavy, so I really need to get a wriggle on. Um, yeah, I've been struggling like, with my, uh, my dry skin and stuff lately. Um, I've been trying face masks and stuff, but they don't really seem to work with my skin. Because my skin's like so... It's sometimes like really oily and sometimes it's like, it's like really dry, so I can't really win over my glass bit, but uh, yeah, it is spitting still, so I'll probably end it from here, uh, from the side of the FB cafe. Um, the beach is still pretty busy, so I'm going to get myself home now, get and chill, and then I might might start putting up my new shelves, uh, just to make, make my uh, sort of desk area look a little bit nicer and look look like a little bit matchy matchy so um but yeah from from Cleveland's beach thanks for watching i'm gonna do my glasses there we go i'll turn it back around so you can see so yeah from a very cold and wet sort of drizzly Cleveland's beach thank you for watching there's that puddle down there that i didn't want to step in So we're going to have a look at the mural, by the way. The uh, might as well just whilst I'm here. I might as well film a little bit whilst I'm here. I've not been vlogging out, out outside for like a week, a week and a bit since I did those two blog videos. Um, plus, uh, yeah, I've not been filming papers for like well, I've not been out and about filming like this for like a week and a bit because I just wanted to rest. That's an old thing, I've just been so mentally like, and physically tired lately as well. I do need to make myself a, yeah. I do need to make myself a film and I like fantasy films. This is what the beach that's what the beach is going to look like by the way when it's all like finished. So you've got all the groins there all along the uh, the beach. Part of the Y Beach management scheme. So we'll just snip down here and a bit out of I think all these kids and stuff have driven scarf in this park over here because uh it's starting to rain. But you got the there's a seagull on top of those rocks. 
Not sure if you folks can see that, but there was a seagull. Can you see him? <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of glad to lose video. Right now, I've got, on my gimbal and on my phone, I've got 18 gigs. Because, I'll tell you, when I got my new phone, I got rid of everything on this phone I'm currently filming on because I, I, I'm not going to like use it daily anymore. I just use it simply just for filming and that's it. And it, now it's got tons of like stories that I can like film with and stuff. It's great. Um, so yeah, here's the yoga with his giant paddle. I think it was a local artist that actually did this. And there's Mary with the with the shell. Their face just looks so realistic though, it's like crazy like how artists can make things so realistic. And here is a wild light in Fleetwood, um, which is been like, it's all like destroyed and abandoned now and stuff and we've got the waves crashing into it. This, this, this bit here reminds me of the Yakman film. Um, there's like bits in there where the camera sort of pans up to the waves crashing on the rocks and stuff. And then you've got all these, um, all these butterflies in here sort of fluttering away from it so yeah okay folks so yeah that is going to be it for this video um this plinth here is hang on. um this plinth there that gets light at the top and night time they look so nice all light with but um, I'm gonna I'm gonna set my bag down here just so that I can put my, put my gimbal away, and place it towards the window. Um, but yeah, um, next time I'll be in Cleveland, Cleveland will be to watch the new Godzilla film, which is just it's just gonna be so so good. Uh, the, as the, the trailer just looks so good. Um, I've seen the first, I've seen like the first two films and they were really really good. Um, but this film, it's not got Millie, Bo Millie, Bobby, B Millie Bobby Brown in it. Um, it's a bit of a different cast, but this, the cast is still, still the same, but obviously without, without her in it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get myself, um, get this gimbal and stuff put, put away now, because it is getting a little bit wet. Um, but yeah, thanks very much for watching, folks. I'm going to set this bag down here, because it is getting quite heavy. I'll quickly show you what I got actually. Hang on, a bit of a B and M haul, a bit of a sneak peek. I've just got some candles. Um, this one is sandalwood and cedar and cardamom because I just love um, the, the cedar wood scent. So I've got two of those. I've got two of these glass sort of um, peninsulas from my new shelves as well. Because my thinking is, I'm gonna put uh, one of these on one shelf and then one on the other one. Um, but I'll probably put my new Aquaman. Um, Pop Funko because I've got a bit of a dangly um, art artificial, artificial plant on that one, um, on one of them, so I'll probably keep that on there. Got some um, cup noodles, number number one in Japan, the teriyaki, um, and obviously my new white shells down there as well, which you folks can see. And then I've got some um, a bag of like pop works popcorn for tonight's film, if we do end up watching it. And then I've got, just got this storage bag because I'm going to start sort of de decluttering stuff in my room that I don't need. Because I've, I've just got so, like so much stuff that I don't really need in my room. So, yeah. Um, it's just start, stopping stopping raining now as well. But from, from uh, Jubilee Park here in Cleveland, thanks very much for watching, folks. Uh, hope you enjoyed a bit of a walk along the, um, the beach with me. I, I quite enjoyed doing these videos and that's sort of what I do with a bit of an ASMR video from Cleveland. Do a few more from Cleveland. Um, I did put up a community po poll up, so hopefully most of you have voted, have voted on that. Um, just to let me know what sort of videos and stuff you want to see from me like, going forward for the rest of the year and uh, next year. Because I've been sort of struggling with video ideas and stuff lately. Um, but. I've just missed sort of like walking around and chatting to you folks. So if you want to see more of this, let me know because I'll more than likely do them. Um, but yeah, we'll have one last look at this mural here before I put my uh, thingy away. I can't believe how lifelike this looks. It just looks so, so good. Got like Mary Shell there. And then Mary and then obviously the yoga with his giant paddle, which is all the way up there, by the way. His giant paddle is like up in the promenade. Um, but yeah, thanks very much for watching folks. Take care and I'll see you all soon. I love this wide wide angle feature on, on my gimbal. I've not I've not put any edit on this at all. It's just part of my gimbal feature that I've got. 
so it makes everything like wide angle whereas my normal my normal phone camera is just, just like bog standard bog standard but i do film through the app so i do film through the gimbal app that's why it's got like the wide angle feature on it at the moment so it just makes everything so much better for me but yeah from here on cleave please thanks very much for watching and i shall see you folks in my next video